USA vs Trinidad and Tobago score, result, highlights as USMNT NAB's lopsided first leg win despite frustrating start in Nations League. Needing a big first leg scoreline to put the US in good position with a chance to advance through the CONCACAF Nations League quarterfinals and qualify for the Copa America, the USMNT ran away late to win 3-0 over Trinidad and Tobago in Austin. After Noah Powder was sent off for a second yellow card before halftime, it seemed goals were inevitable against the Trinidad and Tobago low block. Yet as the 80th minute came and went without the opener, frustration spread rapidly through the fans who were nervous about what would be a massive disappointment. Yet after Ricardo Pepe's 82nd minute opener, the floodgates gave way. Anthony Robinson backflipped his way to a second for the U.S. and Gio Reyna finished it off in the 89th minute to take a 3-0 score into the second leg. The USMNT struggled to create chances through the opening hour of the match, failing to generate a shot on target through the first 55 minutes and failing to find a way through. Yet the tide began to turn as the U.S. got the ball in wide areas more and troubled the visiting back line with crosses and cutbacks, and it again began to feel inevitable. Weston McKenney seemed to win a penalty in the 70th minute, but it was chalked off on VAR. Denzel Smith was excellent in goal, producing a few brilliant saves to increase the tension, but he was finally beaten 10 minutes from full-time. USA vs Trinidad and Tobago Live Updates, Highlights, Commentary Full-time. USA 3-0 Trinidad and Tobago. The first 80 minutes were extremely frustrating for US fans but in the end they managed to run away with a convincing victory, setting up an elementary second leg in Port of Spain on Tuesday. Greg Berhalter used a unique formation and it lacked width, but he got the full backs on the ball more in the second half and eventually they broke through. USA vs Trinidad and Tobago, second half. 90 plus 3 minutes. Fuller and Balogun is dispossessed in the penalty area on what initially looked like a good tackle by a Trinidad and Tobago defender. Yet on replay, it showed that he never got a touch on the ball and just clattered Balogun to the turf. That should be a penalty, but VAR doesn't have a look and play continues. 90 plus 1 minute. A yellow card is shown to Naveel Hackshaw for hauling down Fuller and Balogun in transition. 89th min. Goal. USA. Gio Reyna has a third for the US. They're flying to the final whistle. Fuller and Balogun's dummy has Reyna through on the vertical ball, and he finishes calmly with a left-footed shot that ripples the back of the net. Six minutes of stoppage time are shown, and Greg Berhalter is furious that there's not more after all the Trinidad and Tobago, injuries, and other shenanigans. 88th min. Chance, USA. Fuller and Balogun now has a bad miss. He gets a cross from Anthony Robinson but blasts it over from close range. 87th min. Chance, USA. How did Ricardo Pepe miss? He has a massive chance at the top of the six-yard box but puts it wide. The US are pushing for more as this game winds down, and there will be plenty of stoppage time to come. Exclamation mark. He has a massive chance at the top of the six-yard box but puts it wide. The US are pushing for more as this game winds down, and there will be plenty of stoppage time to come. 86th min. Goal. USA. Anthony Robinson has put the US 2-0 up, and does a double backflip in celebration. It's a long-range deflected effort that suddenly has the US MNT with a very good advantage going into the second leg. His left-footed effort from outside the top of the penalty area took a slight deflection off the head of a defender, and the US are in a great spot. 82nd min. Goal. USA. Ricardo Pepe finally puts the U.S. in front. The substitute has a massive goal for the United States as they take the lead over 10-man Trinidad and Tobago. It's sent in to the near post from Anthony Robinson on the left flank and Pepe deftly flicks it in. The goalkeeper got a hand to it but can't keep it out. 79th min. Chance, USA. Brendan Aronson puts a header wide. Serginho Dest floats it to the far post and Aronson is there, but he flashes it beyond the far post. Ricardo Pepe was waiting behind Aronson had he let that ball go, but the Union Berlin man had to take the opportunity. 73rd min. Chance, USA. 
Serginho Dest the latest to be denied by Denzel Smith. He cuts onto his left atop the penalty area and has a go with his left foot, and forces a diving stop from the Trinidad and Tobago goalkeeper. It's a centrally located shot, but it had enough knuckle that the keeper couldn't do anything but parry it out. Smith, unsurprisingly, needs treatment but is up and will continue. Then moments later Andre Raymond is down injured and needs treatment. The crowd is very unhappy here. They can smell time wasting from a mile away. 68th Min. Chance, USA. Nearly an immediate impact from Brendan Aronson. Gio Reyna finds him with an outside of the foot pass from the left, and Aronson has a rip that goes just wide of the far post. Not far off. 65th Min. Greg Berhalter makes his first two changes of the game as Ricardo Pepe and Brendan Aronson come on the pitch, replacing Kevin Paredes and Malik Tillman. The two young starters didn't have the impact they'll have hoped. Also a double swap for Trinidad and Tobago as Levi Garcia and Jesse Williams come on, replacing Andre Rompersid and Malcolm Shaw. 60th Min. Penalty. USA. Weston McKenney is taken down in the penalty area by Daniel Phillips, and the referee points to the spot. The moment the USMNT was waiting for, and they have a chance to take the lead. It's a pretty clear decision. But no. The referee is going to the monitor for a review. Replay shows that Phillips did get a slight touch on the ball, but it's still a bad tackle through the legs of McKenney. VAR overturns the decision, which is quite generous to the visitors. Re-refereeing the game here, on a bad tackle. Thanks for watching NY Sports News. Stay tuned for more updates.